Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm Scout and I'm here to, I guess, make a YouTube channel for fun about my horses and my country life that I'm living. Welcome to my first video and I'm just going to talk about what I feed my horses. Let's get started. So each of my horses gets three full quarts, which is, this is a three quart of Haystack Special Blend. I've been using these for well over a year now, so that's why I use them still. It's just reliable, it's what my horses were fed before I got them, and it keeps them good weighted and good muscled. So right here is the nutrients label. It has quite a bit of protein, and it has, I mean it's on that little bit higher side for sugars, it's 7% sugar, but um, my horses aren't prone to ulcers. Its ingredients are sun-cured hay, which is alfalfa and timothy hay, beet pulp, flaxseed, canola meal, canola oil, and rice bran. There you go. When we go out and buy the special blend pellets, um, we buy it in like bulk, I guess. We get tons of bags at once and we usually get a percentage off because of that because we buy so much at a time but we've been using it for a long time it has good vitamin and mineral supplements in it so i highly recommend looking at the um thing for what type of grain you feed because that can really tell you um if it's good or not the next thing that i feed is this is the horse guard super weight gain I love this. I've been using it for also almost a year with Tango. He is my Tennessee walking horse. He is older on the really old side, but um, this has helped him put on a little bit more weight. I give him half a scoop, which it came with a scoop two times the size. But I give him this scoop, which is um, two ounces. Now this has a bunch of protein. Minimum is 35% protein, which is really good for if you're trying to get your horse to gain weight. It's good for vitamin and minerals, digestive aids, soy protein, vitamin E and organic selenium, and fat. You should really invest into um, stuff that Horse Guard makes. I love their stuff. I will feed the Apple Elite electrolytes. I love these electrolytes. It's kind of like salt, I guess, in a way, but it is... Um, but it's electrolytes. I like to use this mostly in the summer. I have not really a point in using it in the winter except for if I have a show, which I don't show. So, yeah. This also got wet in the rain, so it's kind of not the normal texture. But I feed them each a scoop about that big um, in the summertime. And you can just substitute salt if you don't want to get this. It has 73% salt maximum, it has 0.75 calcium maximum, and it has magnesium, 0.4%, and potassium. It doesn't have anything crazy, and it is. It's just good. And then it also has on the back, which I've never seen this before actually, is like exercise intensity. You can give it your horse it every four to six hours if needed, or you can use the instructions right here. It helps muscle function and fluid balance. I will feed Buteless. If I did some more moderate work or harder work on my horses and they might be a little bit more sore, I will feed Buteless um, a full scoop. I don't ever, don't feed Buteless if you feed Bute. That's just, it's something it like counteracts and it's not good but this helps um, comfort and re recovery support it's gentle on the stomach so it helps with inflammatory so it's kind of like if you're sore oh there's a huge spider on this you see that he's crawling everywhere oh geez I do not like spiders you are not on my good list Where'd it go? If that thing crawls on my hand, I think he's gone. Nope, he's not. He fell. Okay. Sorry, guys. As Devil's Claw Extract and Yucca 
Schkid Schkidigria extract, which I don't really know what that is, and vitamin B12. It helps ease aches and discomfort associated with normal daily exercise and activity, training, or competition. So I like to use this on, usually if I do, if I did like cutting on my horse Jimmy or anything, I will use this. So this is the brand. It's And then I have this right here, which is regular butte. I don't feed this every day. I only feed this if I notice my horse is lame. Like physically you can see him limping or something. So once if Jimmy lost a shoe, my horse, um, I can give him a scoop of this. This right here is just butte powder. It is molasses flavor. There we go. We just got it um, prescripted for Tango, our um, Tennessee walker, because he got his teeth done and he never had them before. So we didn't want to be sore. We feed ground flaxseed. Once we get everything on the inside covered for, such as why we feed our vitamins and minerals, we can start focusing on the outside, which is the flaxseed. The flaxseed can help um, keep a shiny coat, mane, tail, and hoof growth. Now lastly, our horses get a two ounce scoop of this, which is also by Hoofguard. It's their vitamin and mineral supplement, which is good for digestion and um, more inside needs. I don't have the bag with me because I don't know. I think we threw it away because we just put these in tin cans now. I will put a picture up of that right now. I'll see you guys in my next video next Friday. Bye.